Did you guys see Bronson Lino post me on his stories yesterday? Kind of big time, man. That shows me that I'm doing something right with these reels. So if you guys uh, checked it out, I appreciate all the support. But we got to talk about these more in depth. Uh-huh. But first, I got to grab some stuff. All right, let's talk about it. This is the Action Bronson New Balance 990 V6 in the baklava colorway. For those of you who don't know what baklava is, it's kind of like a, a dessert, a Turkish dessert. Puff pastry, flaky crust, drenched in, I want to say sugar, syrup, honey maybe. You can probably look up recipes on YouTube about it. I don't claim to be a food expert. There's also another colorway that's slated to come out. It's called the Lapis Lazuli colorway. A lot of people like the other colorway more, but you know, I like both. Some quick details, you know, pistachio green on the top. There's this brown premium suede. When I say premium, it's pretty damn premium, okay? You did not skimp on the quality. You got the 3M hits. On the mud guard, silver 3M as well throughout the upper. A little forest green on the interior, orange hue tab, different variations of blue on the midsole and outsole. And of course, you know, New Balance is known for their Fusel technology. Incredibly comfortable. I mean, I can't think of another brand other than maybe Nike that has the most comfort and well-designed, aesthetic-looking sneakers in the lifestyle category. You got Salehis, you got the Joe Fresh Goods, you got the J -j -j Jones. You have Amelie on door. There's a lot of good collaborators with New Balance. If I wanted to give New Balance a run for their money, I'd probably list out some Nike shoes. Nike tends to dominate the designs, but in terms of design and comfort, I gotta give it to New Balance. I will put the Tom Sachs General Purpose shoes up there as good design as well as comfortable. And then when you think about Adidas, you have the Ultra Boost, very comfortable, but design wise, it's like times change. Back then, people were rocking Ultra Boost casually with their fits. And then now it feels like it phased out. It was played out, if you will. Still, two of my favorite colorways right here. The color palettes just work. Purple and pink laser beam rope laces right here. I mentioned this in the, in the reels that I made that Action Bronson is probably the most talented human being on earth. And man, his, his resume is stacked. I forgot to list off that he's a painter. He's an olive oil specialist or connoisseur, if you will. He probably does all his own stunts too, like Jackie Chan. That should be everyone's spirit animal. Action Bronson, Bronson Lino, Mr. Wonderful. Bam Bam Baklava. Yeah, I'm looking forward to the, the Lapis Lazuli colorway. That, that one's a little more toned down. You could probably match it with more outfits. Joe Freshgood is about to drop his New Balance collaboration as well. He came out with a hiking boot and also uh, another hiking trail shoe, which is, I believe it's the New Balance 610V3 or something like that. Let me, let me just double check. I gotta make sure I confirm this. Joe Fresh Goods and New Balance 610 Little Deserts. I like that they're, they're digging into the archives and they're coming out with different uh, silhouettes that you probably don't see often. A lot of people like to stick with the 990s. I mean, it's, I get it. It's very comfortable, it's classic, but I appreciate Joe Fresh Goods for tapping into a different kind of shoe. You could even shout out uh, Bricks and Woods, right? With the 9060s. A lot of momentum behind New Balance, so shout out to the design team at New Balance. Shout out to all the collaborators. I think the only thing that they probably need is to up the basketball department. Get a little more inventive on that end. But in terms of lifestyle, they got it, man. I can't think of a, another brand that's more dominant in pop culture right now. But you guys let me know in the comments, does New Balance dominate the casual footwear department? Until next time, I'll catch you on the next video. Peace.